Hello, I'm Charles, and today we're going to be doing some surface tension science experiments. Something you can do just up for your own curiosity, or something you can do with children to help them learn some science about surface tension. And we're going to be using just some household items you can mainly get from your kitchen. Everybody should have these. We're going to have a bowl for some water. We're going to have some water, just some water out of the faucet. We're going to have some liquid dish detergent, soap. Uh, we might mess with some food coloring, some pepper, and you want the fine ground like table pepper, not the grinder pepper. You want something that'll float on the top of the water. Um, paper towel, a sewing needle, if I can pick it up. A little sewing needle here and I've got some coins quarter nickel penny and dime Let's see if we can't float some of those later I'll go over that a bit closer too so you can see what's going on and I've got a little step stool to get it up off the ground and I'll get the kids and we'll do some science experiments All right, you've seen some of these tricks before, but what we're gonna do, pour some water in the bowl. Plain old water. Bam, clear water. Clear water, nothing in it. Now, we're gonna float some pepper first. It's easy to float the pepper. You knew it was pepper. You knew it was pepper. We're just gonna sprinkle it on there. And the surface tension of the water, you can tell it's still spinning too. The surface tension. Oh, you got a bunch on there, so it shows up on the video better. Dude, you're gonna make a sneeze, man. <laughs> the surface tension keeps that on top. Now, poke your finger in the middle. All right, nothing really happened, right? Now. Rub your, or we'll put some soap. I'll we'll put some soap on her finger right here. Just a, whoa, that's a lot. This is really gonna work. Now poke your finger in the middle. What? What do we do with the food coloring? Oh, with the food coloring, we're gonna try something else. But first, we're gonna pour this out because it's got soapy water in it now. And then. And pepper in it too. And pepper. Um, All right, now there's soap running down my. Me. Can we wash my soapy finger? Well, if we wash your soapy finger, we're going to get soap in the water, and then we'll have to wash it out some more. So don't want to do that, because we need to wash this thing out anyway. I like things including soap. Now, All right, so that's, just... the soap basically broke up the surface tension of the water. And Did you try all of, all, all of this? I haven't tried all of it yet, but we're going to do it, and then... People who watch the video can try it too. I'm gonna to fill this back up with water. We rinsed out some of that soap and we got rid of some of the pepper. There might still be some pepper in there. Now, is a needle going to float or sink? Ooh, float. It's metal. All right, sink. <laughs> but float. there is surface tension. You knew the pepper wasn't that, um, wasn't that heavy wasn't that dense but the needle is very very dense now what we're going to do is we're going to to make it easier because you can just try to float the needle in there and sometimes you can but to make this trick easier we're going to put a piece of paper on top oh and we dropped it in there and the paper sank away but the needle is floating and you can kind of see if you look in there. I don't know if we can zoom in. I can take the needle out for you if we, if you want. Oh me no, to. we're just going to leave it in there now. Now, what's going to happen? Let's see if we can float. First, let's put some water. In, I mean, some soap in our water. Just a tiny, tiny. Put some bit. water in our we soap. We won't. We won't put it near the needle, but we'll put it kind of over here. One little drop. Ooh. And the needle moved to the side, but it did not sink. So, but if you take your needle, let's see if we can 
carefully move it away from the side. Without getting poked? No, what we could do is drop a little drop of soap on the side and it'll push it to the middle. Oh. It didn't hit Go the water. Oh, it sank at that time because it landed right on it. And that's what I was going to say. I can go if the, it. If the surface tension gets... All right, reach in there, but be careful. Don't get stuck. If the surface tension is broken up by either touching the needle or putting some soap in there, it'll make the needle sink. And we'll show that by... Let me see if I can just drop it in there and make it float again. Nope, sank that time. We might have to. There we go. All right, we might have to swirl out that water and put some fresh water. Is that in there. blood or is that food coloring? It's pepper and food coloring, probably because the food color fell over. Mm. I thought it was blood for a second. I was like, ah. like okay. you got stuck. Yeah. We'll put some more of this in here, and we're gonna see how much water does you even get. Now there's water all over the place. Oh, well, there's water all over the place, but we're outside. And it's just water, so it's not hurting anything. We'll get rid of the needle. Get rid of the needle. And we're going to put... Now with the penny... I might start with the dime. Which, which one do you think would float better? Quarter, penny, nickel, or dime? Dime, because it's the smallest. It's the smallest, but is it going to be the lightest? Now what we're going to do is we're going to put it on the paper towel and drop it in there. Oh, no, it sank. Now. I can go and get this. Oh, we're not going to because you might get some soap in there. So now we're going to try. Yeah, but my fingers aren't soapy anymore. We're going to try the penny. The penny. Drink the penny. Boom. And the penny it sank. sank. All right, when we're done with this, I'll get the penny. Okay. Back. Let's try the nickel. I think the nickel's going to sink super big time because it's heavy. Big time. Big time. Oh, what about the quarter? I bet it's probably going to float. It's, the quarter has to float. Nah, because the quarter's pretty heavy. It is big, but it's pretty heavy, so I don't think it's going to have enough surface tension. Let's see if we can ease it in there. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Was I right? 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 Tell me that I'm right. Float, 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 float. <laughs> Nope, didn't float. Maybe if we put them if we put them in there slowly. Let me try the the penny again, but slowly this time. I think I may have dropped it too quickly last time. Oh, and it's got to be dry too, because the water comes up over the edge. Ease it in. Ease it in. May I try the dime? Let's see if we can get the penny. Where to is the first. dime, anyways? Oh, I see the dime. Oh, if you can see, oh, water comes up over the edge. It's not going to float. None of this is going to float. But on to this part of the experiment. Do you remember this when we did this before? Yeah. All right. Do you remember what to do? Um, we'll put that right in the middle, and it's floating. And we're going to take. Some, some red. food, red food coloring. Let's see if we can or put dye. it. Red, or red food dyed. Yeah, red food, food dye, food coloring, food dye. dye. Oh, it's on my finger. Oh no. Oh, that's just in the water. That's way too much, probably. Now I'm going to take a drop of this. Let's see if I can turn it around. Let's see if you could turn what around. The, the little boat thing. The boat thing. And the red food dye went to the bottom, so that's not going to help us on this experiment. But we're going to take this and just put a drop of soap in the middle. What? And you can kind of see the food coloring go. Did you see it? Yeah. It like shot out the back. Wait, what if we put a lot in there? A lot? I don't think a lot would make it go faster or anything. Turn it around. Turn it around. All right, we'll get it pointed this way. All right, let's see. Oh, there's a little bubble. 
Now, why do you think it's not working anymore? Because all the red, red fruit dye is at the bottom. No, probably because I had already broken up the surface tension on the top with the soap. Remember how in the other experiments we were throwing out the soap every time? Mm -hmm. So, let's get rid of Wow, it looks like I'm bleeding. Wah. That was funny. I was like, ah. We'll get it, rid actually, of, it actually really does look like blood. We'll get rid of some of this and we'll put some fresh water in there and we'll do the, uh, the other experiment Ooh, again. Because I think that one's cool. The one with the, the bread thing. Bread? It's a bread tie thing. It goes on the top of bread. Can I put the bread tie thing in here yeah, this time? Make sure it's dried off first. Okay. We're done. Alright, put it in there and try to put it so that the that part is pointing that way and the other part is towards the edge. So this part facing that way? Um the other way. That yeah, way? That way. Yeah, put it easily in there. Yep, try to put it level. Alright, and then we'll take this and we'll go. Just one little drop right in the middle. Ooh, can you see it shoot forward? That was a bigger drop than I thought it was gonna be. But it shot forward. Wait, can we put some food dye in the, in there? Lots and lots of food no, dye? No, we're not gonna put lots and lots of food dye because the food dye... May I put of, just a little bit of food dye You know in what we could do? What? We could put the GoPro in the bottom and do the pepper trick with the GoPro looking up. Or maybe we need a deeper bowl. Let's do that. Yeah. Let's go get a big bowl. We'll All right, I'll, st I'll stay out here. Okay. Well. All right. What I've got now is a bigger bowl full and of water. And some watermelon. And some watermelon. A bigger thing of black pepper so we can put a lot. And I've got the GoPro we're going to put down on the bottom. Is it waterproof? Yes, it's waterproof. That's why we're putting it in there. Now, hopefully it'll be able to see everything. We're going to open up the black pepper and shake, 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 shake. And shake, 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 shake. Shake, 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 we could put the bread thing in there, one of these little bread tie things, and that way we can see the bread boat thing and see how it goes. Mm. But why don't we see it in real life? Yeah, but being able to see like the being it the pepper, see which way the pepper goes and how it propels the boat. So I'm gonna take this and drop it in there. Am I right above it? Ooh, and you saw it that time, didn't you? Mm-hmm. That's pretty cool. So there's the black, there's the, black, black the, pepper on the screen. So. Am I right above it? Ooh, and you saw it that time, didn't you? Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. So, so all the all the soap, basically when the soap went in that one little spot right there, there's that one little split at the end that makes it all come out. I wonder if we could do the pepper again, just the pepper. Oh no, we gotta get that off of there. All right, let me shake some more pepper in here. Or maybe I could stir it around. A lot of the pepper went to the bottom because the soap killed the surface tension. We'll do that other trick too without the thing All right, this time I'll do the trick where I put the soap on the end of my finger which is now red because of the food coloring and it looks like daddy was bleeding all right soap on my finger in three two one Wait, so let me now, in three two one with the GoPro. Three, two, one. Whoa, that was different. Whoa! I did like another one. 
Black pepper. So. It's black pepper all over my hand. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay. You happy now? Yeah. All right, let me get some of this off. You want some soap on your fingers? Mm -hmm. All right, put it right in the center over the GoPro. Three, two, one. Whoa, that was different. Whoa, I did like another one. All right, what we've got now right, is a big bucket of water, some big thing of black pepper, and the GoPro. We're going to put this. Man, down in here. Man, I'm gonna put the black pepper in this time because we gotta be quick because we're gonna be late for gymnastics. Man, Let me get it because I want to get dead center. All right, there's the black pepper. You can go put that inside. Put this right in there. And then the soap right in the middle. And that's how the little boat thing works. All right, this has been Charles. Oh, well. <laughs> and as always, thanks for watching and enjoy.